if you watch movies, you will see the cowboys were the good guys and Indians were the bad guys. They basically painted us as not 100% humans. My name is Armstrong Wiggins. Uh, I'm a Mosquito Indian. The good thing about this center is that we are indigenous people doing work for our people, for our leaders. Our mission, the uh, center provide legal assistance to indigenous peoples of the Americas to combat racism and oppression, to protect their land and environment, to protect their culture and ways of life, to achieve sustainable economic development and genuine self-government and to realize their other human rights. Nobody talk about indigenous people, land being taken away so they have to abandon their territories. Sometimes lawyers are not good with us. That's one of the reasons we do not charge when we represent indigenous community. That's why Indian Law Resource Center work on a law reform to respect Indian law that existed here, not the European legal system. We know the taking of land is one of the most fundamental elements of systemic racism. This project will equip people who should own those lands with the skill set and the capacity to recover their land. Our legal system is listening to our leaders, our elders, from indigenous point of view, how we think about environment, how we think about our water rights, our ocean, our rivers, our land rights. When Indian people defend their land, sometimes they put them in prison, they get killed. I was put in jail because I went to the UN in 1977 to speak about our rights. When I came back, they put me in jail. That historical experience helped us to do this kind of work, how to uh, protect our land, our self-determination, uh, rights, how to govern our people, how to manage our natural resources for the survival of our culture. This effort seeks to allow indigenous people greater land rights through training people in community to understand the law, the titling process, and actually create an institute the first indigenous institute that will title land back to the indigenous people. With this support, 10 years from now, our younger people will carry on, get their land and territories demarcated, legalized. They can have their own bank system if they want to, protecting their lands in, um, sustainably, and they can have their own protected area of their territories. I hope that in the future, non-Indigenous police, non-Indigenous judges respect that legal rights to Indian land so that the rule of law can work for Indigenous people also.